Hey, orange one here. So we are just kind of chilling. We have <laughs> quite a lot of people following us. Um, we're taking castles left, right, and center. I think we have entered the late game. Pretty safe to say. Yeah, we. I think we're going after one of the last Q State castles. Like, I think they might have another one like somewhere around here yeah like up there and another one there as well actually i'm just gonna go for this one and then go for the other ones they're like further down south or some oh hello can i catch him probably not oh he was kind of going for his castle there can i just kind of convince him to run back home maybe go back into your castle yeah, nope. Maybe not. I mean, it's kind of running away from me. <laughs> I think we might be able to just kind of catch him by doing something like this. Um, I don't think you're going to be able to catch him, but maybe you can. Curious. Yeah, I mean, you're actually a little too slow. I don't know. Maybe we'll let her chase him down. Instead of actually fighting him, yeah, we're gonna just, just go after his castle. Sounds good to me. <gasps> I don't want to pay this dude off. No, no thank you. We'll just siege him down and take their castle. Kind of like what we've been doing the last couple episodes, just kind of sieging places down, taking them out, you know. Let's just get this, this show on the road. Yeah, I think that we've definitely reached the end again here. There's, um, I just dismissed you from my party. You got so many people in your party. That's just nuts. Why don't you come back here? I don't think you're going to actually catch the dude. Oh my gosh, look at all these people that want to join. That's insane. I didn't realize I had so many people that wanted to join. I think we've got a lot of high stats right now. Actually, I don't think I've shown you guys our stats page in a while. I should probably do that don't we, while we're having this all kind of get built. Show that off. Let's get that higher as well. Um, so what was it? Yeah, C. So yeah, check it, check it out. We got, wow, well, that's actually pretty high on the bows as well. Um, I've heard that some of the skills, the perks are finally getting enabled. So maybe we'll get some more stuff from that. Um, but like, yeah, look at how much charm we have. It's just absolutely insane. So we get every five skills past 150. It gives me more influence per day. So I get immortal charm. So that should be giving me... Is that active? I don't think it is. If that was, then... <laughs> We'd be rolling in a lot of influence, but we're not. Unfortunately, it doesn't work. If it did, we would just be absolutely overpowered. Okay. Hey, he's back. Too late. I tried to have you join me. You had your chance. And I mean, we should actually, yeah, I was thinking we should take some other places. Oh, we got Varchag again, because didn't we get that recently? I kind of wanted to just kind of show you how hard my lords were working, taking places for me. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> Dude's been with us for a while, so have you. Both of them are very loyal, good lords. I think that we've... Um, taken on quite a few people but at the same time it's kind of like balanced out now like the certain tiers have like similar amounts if like those guys are getting more you know like that guy just got a city a city that dude's like super rich and gather I don't know what um, his clan is to be honest uh, let's get that put away maybe uh, Maybe you can hold off on that. I want that getting built right now. We'll get the ram soon. Yeah, I've got tons of food as well, so... 
We got 48 days worth of food. We're good. All right. Um, yeah, let's throw these down. The ram going and the towers. And things should be getting interesting soon. Okay, well, one of my people have, at least one of them have ran out of food. I'm giving them food, which will give me more influence, which is kind of nice. That'll help me maintain the army. Oh, well, there goes one of them already. Get that going. Yeah, we could probably charge the walls, like, now. Honestly. We have the numbers. We'll get the towers. I don't want to charge without any towers. We could probably go for it now, but we'll just wait a little bit longer. We're just destroying it. Very nicely. And, yeah, we'll get our recruits and we'll attack. I want to get actually to attacking a proper city, because we haven't attacked one in a while. We've been just finishing off the Kuzate over here. Uh, yeah, go ahead and actually attack. We've got like 200 plus more than them, and we've got all of our siege equipment going. And it's not trebuchet, so it's not going to like knock them all out, but eh, it'll be pretty good. That's pretty good. In six minutes to get into the siege, it'll probably take us at least like five, like five to eight minutes to get through this, and then we should be able to get to like another city, I think. I don't know. I don't think we'll be able to take out the whole map in 10 episodes if I'm showing all, all the stuff that we're taking. I might not show every, everything being taken, though. Oh my gosh, headshot. <laughs> Second one was not a headshot, though. It's good enough, though. Enough to kill him. That was a headshot. Oh no. That was definitely a headshot. And that was not. Nope. Okay. Cool. <laughs> There's something really satisfying about doing that for some reason. But these guys, we have them pretty well suppressed. They don't have a lot of archers shooting down at our guys. Yeah, nice. Oh, there's a dude up there now. Ooh, I think he might have been aiming at me. It looks like he might be. He was, now he's dead. Oh, there's a javelin there. Don't throw a javelin at us. Good for them. Yeah, okay. I wasn't sure if we were going to get that one or not. Pretty far shot. I think there's more people, like, hiding in those slits, you know? We'll get to them, though. Don't worry. It's kind of like, with these things down below on the hill, it's kind of like, it's kind of hard to actually hit the top, it looks like. I think there's an archer over there, yeah, there's someone with, like, a javelin or something. Shooting through the smoke at him. Uh, there's a dude right there with that siege equipment that I might be able to hit. Nope. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to. That's a pretty hard shot. Oh, I think they got him. I think someone might have hit him. The siege equipment. <laughs> siege versus siege equipment, right? Okay, yeah, I got that ram on there. That tower there. Yep, we got this. Oh man, so I've got my... I've been playing around with my setup for school, for like, um, doing the recordings for school. And guess what I did? I got a green screen. <laughs> I don't really have it properly set up right now, it's kind of weird. The lighting is all kind of bizarre in the room, so it, the... One of the corners isn't really green, it's like white, with all the light that it's getting, so it just went hard. <laughs> but, yeah. Oh, see. oh, geez. Oh gosh, did you see that? I'm <laughs> jumping down. Good gosh. <laughs> that was pretty nuts. Okay. At least this gate is pretty much down. It doesn't look like they're dropping anything on us either. Okay. We got this. Pretty soon. 
Oh, they're now shooting at us. We gotta be careful here. Can I get any shots at them? Not really. Um, where are the archers? There's some right there. Oh, I can hit a couple of them. <laughs> Very rewarding. Can you hold them like that? Um, oh man, there's a lot of people here. I've only got six arrows as well. I gotta be careful about what shots I take. Yeah, let's go melee. Yeah. Not gonna be able to hit as, as many, but I'll be able to conserve my arrows, which I should be able to use maybe now. I get a good shot opportunity. No, I don't really. Almost, almost. Nope. Save yourself. I think we're almost falling back here. It's crazy. Yeah, no, we're good. As soon as I get. Nope. <laughs> See. Take that, dude. Yep, take that. These guys are too dumb. Yep, they're so dumb. I actually should have arrows they drop there for me. Oops. There's actually a whole lot of them here in this courtyard. We're kind of getting chewed up. I can kill the, the more heavily armored. Or at least just kill. Just kill. Then we should be. Ooh. That guy's got like a uh, scythe or something. He's trying to swing at us from a distance. Uh, yeah. Oh man. I'm getting so many good hits like that. Oh, they're running away. Yeah, we'll take that dude. Any arrows that I can pick up here, please? No, no arrows. Gosh dang it. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, it looks like the game's set it so I don't have unlimited things anymore. Can I set it back to that, please? Um, battle size, unlimited. Corpses, unlimited. Ragdolls, right? So that should make it so. I should have all the items, right? Is that not an option now? Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. Okay, well, looks like items are despawning. And I'm not sure how to change it back so that they don't. Cause I, I liked having all the items on the ground and be able to pick up all the stuff. Like that's annoying not being able to shoot people because I can't pick up items that despawn. I mean, sure, maybe you can say people were looting or whatever, but nah. Come on. There's 25 of them, really? Oh, look, there's arrows here. Okay. Um. There we go. Okay. Oh, I can hit them now, though. Yep, okay. Well, now I know. There's actually, that kind of makes sense. It's like at their archery range, too. Oh, cool, the 46. I think we might be able to take that amount with us. I mean, there might be some that we can just donate, but we've got probably some special ones that we don't want anyways, you know. And the war machine goes on. Yep. Okay. It's mine now. Sorry, buddy. Um, I'm actually gonna let some people go. 
I want to actually click on this because I want to do multiple. Yeah, you go. You go. Eh. I think I'll let those guys stay. And then we'll go to the dungeon. Prisoners. Drop a couple of the ones that are just terrible or not recruitable. I think that might be enough. Now we need to get rid of a few more. Is that it? Yeah, okay, cool. I don't think I can catch him. He's too quick. We'll just wait here for just a little bit. We'll let us give it to someone else and then we'll maybe attack him. Oh, apparently someone's starving still. Okay, yeah, yep. Yeah. That took a while for some reason. Yep. Yeah. Cool. And then we'll let people donate to here and then we'll kind of roll out. Awesome, that was oh dude, they yeah, they got they've got enough to defend against Talser's armies now. We're good. We're totally good. We're good to go. Oh, well, I, as I was saying that, he's over there just stomping on some of my dudes. Let's see if I can catch him. Nah, I don't think I'm going to be able to. It's just a little too quick for me. Maybe I'll be able to corner him, though. Might be able to get him. B. Nah, I don't think we will. Okay. Whatever. Not worth my my time, honestly. We're gonna make our way down to the south and we're gonna just push through there. And who knows, maybe we'll make some friends along the way. Hawker, can I get there? Let's just go by there. There's gonna be some good units that we could probably pick up there. And we'll just keep on going south. Yeah, I think the fact that we've got um, all these places here now that are ours. Oh my gosh, what do we have now? I don't even know where that is. <gasps> do I even care? Let's go get some dates. We'll go get some dates. I think people are gonna need food. This dude's like my super homie. He's like, I can tell that he's an Asari dude. So it's like, yeah, definitely happy with him getting some land. Should probably make other people a little bit more happy with us though, right? Oh man, look at that. This place loves us. We did this like, this was like our questing territory for a while. Oh man, also people are so hungry they bought all their dates in our army. <laughs> Let's go by the city. We'll let people buy things at the city and we'll keep on rolling south. Yeah, look at the map. We basically own... Oh, they've taken Varchag back. It looks like we're kind of taking things from them and then they take it from us. <laughs> Constantly. And they're definitely winning battles. Let's, let's not forget that. I mean, if we're looking at our strength compared to theirs, though, it is vastly different. You know, you gotta admit that. But it's still, like, they, they are still a considerable army. Okay, I will take all of your grain. Basically, all of your food. Um, including those sheep. And you can take... Oh, yeah, I'm just gonna raid with like weapons like that we'll see what we can get from from him okay sure whatever i really don't care weapons for food pretty good deal that's like the messed up version of settlers of Catan. <laughs> right <laughs> i'll give you two weapons for one sheep <laughs> kind of want to play that game now. Even though it's like kind of like the whole point of Sailors of Catan is that there's not like that kind of craziness. It's like you have to play kind of nicer. 
you know. <laughs> Whatever. Oh man, look at this this army. This is a pretty nice army we got rolling here. And we got these cities that we used to like trade between. You remember that? Like I remember that salt mine. We used to take salt over there and whatever over here. I think dates. Dates and salt, I believe, was the trade. And I totally would mess it up by trading way too much of it. And lose all my profit. <laughs> All right, we're going to go for... I think I'm going to skip over the castle and just go for the city. And see how many people I can... Oh, hello. Never mind. What have we got here? We got an army of 900 just rolling around. Um, who have we got around? Why don't y'all come over here? Why don't we see what we can do against the um, palace's army here? He's going to fight Kaon. We might be able to cut him off a little bit. Oh, the Northern Empire is at war with us. Oh no. Um, Phi Kaon is over that away. I'm gonna just really quick. No, nothing. We're just gonna stay ahead of him, honestly. See what we can find. Um, we we'll probably have enough food now. I don't see the army now. Where did they go? Where did the super army go? They're not at Dynastica, are they? We go back there. I think they must have like gone over this way somewhere. I'm not seeing them. Where did they go? Laviston? Yeah, I'm not seeing that. We can also just kind of, with our big ol' army now, head out somewhere. Take some out. Yeah, you jerk. Get out of here. Get out of here. I could just, like, siege this. And that would probably make them angry enough to actually just come attack me. Now I'm gonna just... I don't know. We've lost the, the big army, so we're just gonna go into their territory before I got... Oh, Tyus and Tamir. Got you. We're just gonna just roll on past that. We're gonna just go through here, maybe buy some dates. Yes, because we're civilized, we don't just attack everyone. We're gonna go into your territory with our like thousand plus stack. Um which would not be a problem for me if the mechanics of the game were actually working with the charm. <laughs> or whatever. Oh look, we got some fish here too. Cool. And dates there. Yeah, we'll just buy all of your food and recruits. Nope. And then we'll attack the city. See, the people here, they love me. We understand each other. Oh, there's Sirk, the king. I'll let him go to the city and then we'll take the city and, you know, have him captured. And I think I would actually take him prisoner if that were to be the case of what... How this goes down. Yep, go in there. Cool. Okay, uh, they have a thousand people in the city. That is a lot of people to have in a city. That means that they most definitely have, um, you know, an army in there. An army's worth of troops in there. So if we can take them out, then good for us. And, you know, they're gonna have to reinforce them, so even better, right? Oh, you guys are a day away. Cool. Come on, come on over. We might be able to just rush this place and just like, you know, have like a death stack. I don't know. We'll see. It might take us a while to get all these built. While we're working on this, I bet that they send someone over. They they had like a 900 strong army, so I bet they send more. But we have people coming. I can also let loose some people as they get hurt. So we got attacked. What I've found is that lords can't really sustain a thousand troop armies, so if you have the ability to do so yourself, like I do, it makes it so they can't really stop you from taking the city. 
it's very, very, very useful. Like, yeah, you can stand there with your 96, sure. Good for you. Get out of here, right? <laughs> I mean, look, I've got 1,200 troops. They're defending... Um, sure, okay. All right, hold on, I think I'm getting like a text. Uh, will that keep on going? Okay, nothing. Very cool. Okay, oh, am I? This better be... It's a trebuchet, okay, good. I built one not trebuchet. Yeah, it should be fine. We're just trying to basically weaken down their, their walls a little bit, and then we'll attack. We've got the numbers to just, like, win, so, yeah. Anybody nearby? I don't think we need them. And look at how many people we have. That's insane. Okay. Let's see what we can do here. What powers are getting built? These things should. Oh, that's just well done. That's not good. Yeah. Okay. Well, we'll see what we can do with what we have. I think that that's good enough. Just about. Maybe we'll try and get one of these built in the meantime. Yeah, they got a lot of things hurting us right now, but we have the towers. And the siege equipment is kind of working right now. Rami wants to let us get a few more. Yeah, now we've lost. Now we're just at two trebuchets. That's not good. They're getting messed up too. At least the walls are kind of hurt. We've got towers, but I don't think that that'd be quite enough. At least we got that now. That's good. We can start getting some damage on them. Okay. And while we're doing this, we have that benefit of everything around us. Gang raided and whatnot. <laughs> right. Like, look at this. There's... Oh, look. Off castle. Oh, it's being besieged. Okay, let's give it to someone. Yep, sure. I need to remember to do that while we're, like, taking the city, you know? Now the question is, should I attack right now, or say that for the start of the next? I think we'll start by the next episode with it. It just kind of seems to make sense, you know? Okay, we got more siege equipment up now, but it's kind of like not great siege equipment. The walls are kind of hurt, right? Yeah, see, this is kind of an uphill battle that we're in. At least the, the walls are kind of damaged. Okay, I'm going to end this here, and then we'll start the next one here. Okay, thank you for joining me. This has been Orange One.